Polish egg, three eggs, DX. But before we get started, man, you know, I expect you know this one, right? You have to know this one. So what does that mean? It means you have to know cos 3x meaning equal to 3 cos x sin square x plus cos cube x and then cos square. When you say cos square x minus sin square x always equal to 1. Okay. So let's go, man. So let's plug it in. So we're going to do the face steps here. Excuse me. What I want to do, I want to eliminate this cos, cos 3x. So what is cos 3x? It's okay. So this one you have to know. I mean, this you have to know. So cos, this will be sin x, but cos 3x meaning 3 cos. That's identity. This is a hyperbola identity. Identity. This is hyperbola. This is a hyperbola identity. Hyperbola identity. Hyperbola identities. This is a hyperbola identity. So cos 3x or cos 3x and know what the value of cos 3x. Cos 3x meaning equal to 3 cos 3 cos x. Pen, man. This pen is finished. 3 cos x. Sinh. Square x plus cos cube x. Okay, so now we have a dx here. <coughs> Excuse me. So the next step. The next step what I'm going to do, this one, this is integral. So there's an integral right there. So this is integral. Okay, next step I'm going to multiply in. So it's going to be integral. Let's multiply in. This going to be sinh. 3 sinh x cos x and I have a sin square x plus sin cos cos cube x dx but also Okay, so then, <coughs> excuse me, next step, I'm going to separate this. See what I'm saying? Because if, look, cos square x means 1 plus c square x. So what happened? I'm going to break this into cos square x. So we'll have an integral, c x multiplied by 3 cos x, c x, and this will be plus, I'll say cos square x. <coughs> or say cos x times cos square x. Why do this? Because I know the value of cos square x is equal to 1 plus sin square x. So I'm going to plug it in here. So this is going to come in here. So say, okay, integral, sinh, x, 3 cos, x times sinh of x. <coughs> Just me, this is sin square x. Sin square x plus cos x. Okay, what the value of cos x? 1 plus sin square x. And then we have a bracket dx. So I'm saying I can multiply that out. So let's multiply that out. Let's multiply that out. So this will be equal to integral. Yeah, this pen is finished. So I'll go back. So integral. Integral. And then another pen. Integral. So integral. Sinh. And then 3 cos x, 3 cos x, and then we have sinh, and then multiply that out, that's going to be cos x, and that's going to be plus cos x, sinh, square x, dx. Why do this? Because look here, I have a cos sinh square x, cos sinh square x, so oh, oh, I can add them together. So 3 cos sinh square x, 1 cos t, this is like a 1, 1 cos sinh, I can put them together. So this is going to give me 4. So this is going to give me 4 cos x sinh 
square x and then plus cosh x. <coughs> Excuse me. Plus cosh x. And then he also I have a sin x. And I have my integral and I have a dx. Dx. So what is the next step? Next step I'm gonna multiply in. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, let's multiply that in. Next step, put it in, man. So let's multiply that out. Yeah, we can do it. Multiply that out. Uh, hold on, hold on, face. I have a cosh, cosh. Why I don't put this uh, cinch in the take cosh out? I could do that, man. For some reason, because I want to let cinch equal something. Or I can let cinch straight away, but no. Let me take cosh out. Let's take cosh out for some reason, and then put cinch in. Why? Because I want to let. So if I put this in, it's going to be easy, because this cinch is going to be closer to other cinch, and this cosh is going to be to separate. So this I'll take out, and I'll put cinch in. So it's an integral. Take cosh out. And then I'll put cinch in, so it's gonna be cinch, four cinch, cinch, cinch cube. So then after that, so what we do is okay. So let's get it, man. So it's okay. Let's get it quick. So this is gonna be, uh, we say we take cosh out, and then we substitute cinch in. So cinch is gonna be cinch cube, and then this side is gonna be plus only cinch x because cos and cos went out, and then we put cinch above. So this is gonna be cinch and the dx. So here, it's going to be easy for me because I want to let. I want to let. Let. You, okay, any of Let's say you, okay, whichever one. Let's say you. Let's say uh, you. You equal to sinh of x. So when you differentiate du, it's going to be equal to cos of x dx. Which is easy. <coughs> See what I'm saying? So now we're going to say, before we do that, right, uh, let me rearrange this so well. So let me rearrange so well. Uh, I could have said this, same as say, in a group. I'll take this cosh in front. So just rearrange it. So this could be 4, sinh, sinh cube x plus sinh x. And then this cosh, let me put in front. So it's going to be cosh of x dx. Okay, so now we say we let u equal to sinh of x, u equal to sinh of x, and then we differentiate u equal to cos of x dx. So what happened? So now we know, excuse me, the value of u equal to sinh x means this is going to be sinh x, so I'm going to say okay. So this one here is going to become integral, okay, for what the value of sinh? u, so u. But what? q. Plus sinh of x, what is sinh of x? u plus u and then times cosh x dx, what is cosh x dx? du, du and the question is finished man so this is say you can differentiate this one before u power 4 over 4 plus u square over 2 plus constant I hope everybody know how to differentiate the part there <coughs> excuse me so man the space is finished here man so I'm going to make a space over there, so it's okay. Try to make a space. Take this one here, take this one here, and this one right here. So this is finished. So now I have... Okay, let's finish it. I believe we can finish everything, okay. So now I have... For u, means one integral. It's going to be 4u power 4 over 4. So these 4 and 4 cancel. So u power 4 plus u square over 2. So finally, integral of for you, for you. Okay, so <coughs> excuse me. So plus u, u square over two. Uh, u, u plus u, excuse me, plus u. Du give us uh, u power four, u power four plus u square over two, plus u square over or two plus constant. But we know the value of u, right? We let sum. What the value of u? Sum. We let equal to sinh of x. You can change your facts, so plug it back, so you say insert or set insert back the value of u, but u equal to sinh of x. Sinh of x. So I can substitute back. So substitute it back. So now you're gonna get, okay, so this is gonna be what is the u sinh of sinh of x but a power four. So four x plus sinh square x over over two plus constant. That's the final answer. Done already, man. <laughs> That's the final answer we done already. See, so, excuse me, you could say, when you integrate, when you integrate, sinh, 
Sinch, excuse me, sorry. Sinch of x cos 3x dx. You get sinh of all x plus sinh square x over 2 plus constant. This is sinh here, I call it not sinh, sinh, sinh. That's a fun answer, man. Thank you for your time, man. If you face time on my channel, make sure you subscribe, you like, and share. Don't forget to share with other people. Also, I got my Facebook, uh, my Facebook page so you can like and share. Twitter page, everywhere, man. Share with other people, man. You have any question? Leave a comments. I'll get back to you. Thanks a lot, man. Thanks for your time. I appreciate your time. Thanks, man. Love you guys, man.